I remember that we used to be different. We used to live up there, on the surface. We used to be the masters of the whole world. We built gigantic cities of glass and steel. We crossed the oceans at will. And we also conquered the skies. There used to be seven billion of us. We were not born for life in the tunnels. I was born to breathe fresh air, and I remember it. The seven billion were wiped out by the last war. Only 50,000 managed to survive underground, with the surface poisoned, burned, and teeming with horrible monsters. One day, the radiation on the surface might subside, and our grandchildren, or their grandchildren, might be able to return there. At least that's what my brothers in arms from the Order believe. Basically, there was no hope for us right off the start. Still, we humans are just too bad at surrendering. We tried to make the best of what we had, banded together, and worked to make the Metro our new home. After all, it might well be the only place left on Earth for humans to live. For a time, we thought we could make it, but, regrettably, the war didn't kill our bad habits. In the relative safety of the tunnels, corruption festered. And when danger came from above the ground, only a few of us stood against it. Our numbers dwindling by the day. But I remember we were born for a better life. And I can't accept that I'm destined to grow old and die underground. I don't care if I'm called an idiot. But if even a single shard of the old world still exists out there, I have to find it. Between endless years of hopeless existence and even a single moment of hope, I must choose hope. I must find that signal.
Artyom, stay they with us. They're coming back. Attention, people. Oh, look, it's the hero. Margo, it's nighttime at the station. Don't worry. I told you. I, I got it. I got it. Open up. Station. Go. Where to now? Left, across the square! Hey, Demir, do you think the Colonel knows what Artyom been up to here? How am I supposed to know? Ask him yourself. He radioed from the ring, said he'd be here tomorrow. Hey, you! Leave him alone! I killed him myself with my slingshot. Let him learn to stand up for himself. How else can he hope to survive in the metro? Rise and shine, people! Hang in there, Artyom. You gonna get a fresh dose of Spartan blood now? Artyom, are you awake? It's okay. The doctor said you'll be fine. Are you trying to kill me with worry? What if next time you don't return from the surface? There's no one out there, Artyom. No one to find, no one to talk to. If there was, don't you think they'd be here already? We've talked about this again and again. You have to accept it. There's only us. Colonel. Hello, Alex. There you are, you stubborn fool. How many times are we going to have this conversation? I don't care if you kill yourself over this silly dream of yours. But don't you see what you're doing to my daughter? Your wife? Dad, please. The order is short on men after the battle for D6, but you leave. People need you, and you pursue your selfish obsession. But now this shit has to stop. There's only Metro, nothing else. And the order is here to defend it. Because if not us, then who? You look fine to me. So get ready to go. Then, we'll discuss your transfer to Polis. Come, we need to talk. I'll get the doctor. Artyom, please, promise me this was the last time. I'll see you later. Artyom, we managed to bring you back from the brink, but... People are giving you their blood, which could save so many wounded, and you keep bringing it back irradiated. Don't you think that is unfair? Let me put it this way. I can't promise I'll be able to bring you back next time. Still, lucky those Spartans are damn good. They brought Artyom here just in time. They sure are. I cannot remember the last time I saw a bunch of healthy and fit people down here. Nah, me neither. It's a shame they spend so much time on the surface. Eh? Well, sadly, it's their job. <laughs> job or no job, if they keep doing that. You must come back to Polis. Oh, I can't believe my eyes! Artyom! You're all right. You gave us a scare, scare brother. Artyom! How are you, friend? I see Pardon you're all me, right. Gentlemen, give this way. calls for a celebration. Artyom. A few more scars and you will be completely irresistible to any woman. Speaking of which... Hello, How you're are you? Are you just guys, huh? you just stop crowding him. Brother. Brother. Ah, ah, Artyom. All right, you're all dismissed. I give you two hours, people. Yeah! <laughs>
Oh, yeah. it's a fish. Yeah. I knew it. You guys are like, so I brought something. And here we go again. <laughs> Please, let's not repeat the last Hold time. Hold on, Artyom. Ah, <sighs> yes. And there's also those damn things. Calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? Silent, Artyom? Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Move it. We don't need any extra radiation, darling. Oh, father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off-limits zone. to all these ruins? should come back to the order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go and turn to her. It's not stable enough. Careful. At least it held. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Look, hear that? didn't notice us. That was a large pack. Oh, is this why the zone is off limit? I mean, if all the packs here are like that.
You should have checked first, assholes. Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one Look for that. what's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you were right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we we'll tell the whole Metro about this. The heck and the boy, out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back.
damn watchman broke through. Some workers are done for you. Keep your weapon trained. Okay. If anything comes through, shoot. Attention! The turntable is switching on. Out of here, we won't accept this shit again. Okay? Animals. How can they? What can I do? The mutant? The watchman! A human? How did you... Oh. oh my god. It's you she's been screaming about. Alive! You came for her. All right. I'll help. Finally. I'll be of some use. Okay. They took the girl to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we're both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Sergeant. Senya, go tell the work. Crouch. Hey, don't make noise. Oh, you turned quite civil again, Yermak. Stay close to the wall. You'll head after all. <laughs> Yermak, is that you? What are you modeling? Come here and help me fix this. Yes, sir. Got me over me. Come on, come on. Fixing this should be nothing for you. Distracting him. Look, there's some garbage around. Throw some. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. Come on. 
Sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go. Oh, I'm not very Who are you? Andre Ivanovich Yermak, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar and then God willing, I'll get you out of here. They know me, so I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. Hey. Hey. Artyom, I see the enemy. Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Atyom, incoming two of them. I'll give you some cover from above.
Attention! The command center is under enemy attack! Changing position, Artyom. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon immediately. Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Attention! The jamming system is coming back online. Artyom, the hangar is right there. We can break through. Am I glad to see you here? Are you alright? I'm fine, thank you. Alright. We don't have much time. They'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the young. turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base on us.
Kion, we don't have all day. Situation here. Honor! Dad! Guys! It's us! Help us! What Honor. the hell? Uh, Artyom! What are you doing here? Talk about surprise! Well, it will mean court martial for all of you. Break everyone! Shut up! I can't believe this. Just can't believe this. Shit! So this is true? You are working for them? The bastards shot Artyom! Be quiet! They how did you end up here? Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. You have no idea what you just stuck your heads in. We've no moves left. Hans, I can't take this line oh, now. Shit, the watchers won't let No, I won't be quiet. What is this jammer for? Why are they hiding the fact that Moscow didn't survive alone? There, what is in the Anna's ravine, about, there are sir? people uh, from other cities force. dead. All Everyone of them, women, up. children. I'll tell you all later. Gramps, what's going on out there? Down this road. The road is fine, at least until a hundred click mark. Is there a safe place to stop nearby? Of course. We have to make haste, though. They got the cruiser. All right, gentlemen. Artyom and Anna have just made a huge mess, and I can't go back to Moscow now. The wartime legislation dictates they be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to not my this call, and you're not. misunderstanding. Well, I'll jam. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course. Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. It's it's not not us. Us. All right, Spartans. Throw these overboard and pull steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. 
Let's catch them there. I'm so glad the boys supported us. It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! Your lucky, your daughter. 
We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. Hmm, so... Telling the truth. It's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick you together. Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. Yermak, full steam ahead. Hi. Uh, full oh, steam ahead. Uh, wow, oh, that's yeah, some I distance. I wonder how long it will take. How are you, Alyosha? Oh, Anna. I was expecting an arrow from a kid. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they? while we were eating each other alive in the metro. We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller, and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small... Froze anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, Thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Shots fired! 
Alert! Four bogies on a trolley! Are you alright, Artyom? Damn! They pierced the cylinder! How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck! Oh, shit! Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could have put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that bridge. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? I don't know yet. I can't check on that cylinder, but a full day at least. I see. Get to it then. Spartans, let's, let's go, Artyom. Aurora for a defensive action. Stepan, Damir. Get the perimeter. I'm on yes, sir. You, I need you to be on the Don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. Yes, sir. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Let's move out, Artyom. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys. Well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Do you hear that bell? We must have given them a good scare. Took a look around while you're inside. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. Artyom, don't wander off. What would you do if some beast came and ate your wife?
boat at the dock. Get over here when you're done. Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. <laughs> I'll call you when I'm settled. Break a leg. Salantius has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. Silantius locked us up here a year ago. Yes, the bridge dwellers won't even talk to heretics. But I'll tell you everything I've seen in this place all that year. Oh, it's the bridge guard. Silantius fooled them just like the locals. But unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Run! There's a way out down here, and there's a boat at the dock. We also have one, but it's too small for all of us.
Artyom, I can't cover you when you're inside. I'm changing position to meet the woman and child. I know you can handle this just fine. I give up! Hey, if they say you worship the devil, that too, will you teach me? I'd make a good apprentice. A really, really good one. Come on, teach me.
What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And holy shit, you did not disappoint. Anna has already reported on that. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? But I have to say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with a dumb spyglass. Here though, we do have a chance of finding some loot. There is this plane there. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. The shrimps are giving me trouble, though. I wish I could somehow talk to that catfish into chomping all those water bugs. How, how did Mowgli talk to the animals, I wonder? Speaking of Mowgli, we have the same blood type, you and I. Haven't you noticed? <laughs> well, I guess you have to go now, Artyom. I feel your father-in-law training his... You're alive! For the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Artyom, a moment. 
think him. you are so if not for you, you you're done never talking to the old man. I've got there something for you. Great job saving the Martin. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we're to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yeramak can't handle the repairs alone. So once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. When we'll get back ASAP, we'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably get us in the key regions only. In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local... Damn. To put things in. What do I even do about this? Hi, Artyom. Hello again, Artyom. You did great out there. Or so everyone says. <laughs>